once again welcome back to my channel in today's tutorial i want to show you how to remove a video background in adobe premiere pro so this is a progress bar and then i want to show you how we can actually remove the background and make this video actually transparent i'm going to work you through everything step by step with no step skip so let's jump right into this so now for premiere what i'm going to do is uh, i'm going to go to effects i'll go to effect over here and then search for ultra key so I'm going to drop this ultra key on my video like this so when I, when I drop this ultra key you can see at the control panel or at the effect controls I have the ultra key settings over here just go to the key color here pick the eyedropper tool and then click on the background here and then it's going to remove the background now you can see it's not completely removed so you can go to the settings here and then change from default to what aggressive so when you change it to aggressive you can see now the background is completely removed but there's something we can do over here we can actually go ahead and then come to the settings options over here go to the settings option here click on this settings option and then just select what transparent grid over here and you can see now it's showing completely off the background is completely off now we can actually export this and then use it on top of any other video we have so i'm going to show you how to export this next so what we're going to do is that we'll go to file and then we'll go to export and then we'll go to media now give your file a name so i'm just going to call this progress or loading bar i'm going to call this loading bar and then for the format i'm going to select quick time so so i'm going to select quick time for the format so because you want to keep the background as transparent make sure from the option here just select quick time from here so select quick time and then under the video codec just go ahead and select animation from here so select the animation and then go down here and then for the depth select what a dash b pc plus alpha so select that and every other thing should be the same now you can also select the location where you want to save your videos to i'm keeping my own at videos i have a folder for that so what i will do next is to go ahead and click on export so click on the spot and then it's going to export this video after that we'll bring it to premiere and i'm going to just confirm this we'll bring another video and try to place this progress bar on top and let's see how this is going to look like okay so i'm done exporting my video now what i'm going to do is that i'll delete this work from the timeline and then drop a video right here on the timeline so i'm going to just keep my uh, sequence settings so i have a video now on my timeline and then i want us to place the progress bar on this just to confirm that the background is indeed transparent okay so let's go back i'm going to pick my video without the background remember i save it loading bar so this is actually my loading bar i think this is it so i'm just going to drag, drag this to premium okay. okay so now i can move this on top of my video just to confirm that this video is actually having a transparent background so i'm just going to drop it here so you can see from my video here you can see my background my background is actually transparent the progress bar is not displayed on my original video so basically this is a very simple technique to use to make a video background completely transparent so i'm able to place the progress bar now on top of my original video so it's actually working effectively so this is how to make a video background transparent and you can use it on top of other videos using adobe premiere pro like subscribe for more videos like this like coming away again bye bye